We deliver cleaning services at Terminal 3. Uh, we've been there for three years now. We cover front and back of house and high level cleaning and we've currently got a team of just under 800 staff there. So we want to deliver uh, training to international standards, so we're now accredited by BICS, it's the British Institute of Cleaning Science. Um, the idea behind it is that it's practical learning. So we've set up a training room on site, um, which is an actual uh, washroom, an actual area of the airport, so it provides like a live training environment um, for our team. And we've put a dedicated assessor on site, um, so he can actually perform the assessments there at the airport. Um, so BICS is very practical training, it's hands-on learning um, and because it's very specialist we actually limit the number of people to five so we just have five cleaners going through the training at any one time. Um, we also deliver customer service training on site at the airport, um, it's obviously crucial that our housekeepers uh, deliver excellent customer service in addition to be able to deliver cleaning services. Uh, we're delivering machine operator training, um, which is related to the cleaners that operate cleaning machinery on site. Um, and obviously health and safety training is also delivered as well. Unfortunately not. Uh, it's an extremely challenging environment, um, especially at DXB. I mean, it's the world's busiest airport. Uh, we have over 60 million passengers annually going through. Um, it's 24-7 operation, so we don't have that shutdown flexibility. So the luxury to be able to close off an area or um, stop, work, stop anything working just so that we can clean it isn't there. Uh, so we really do have to work around the airport uh, operations and we have to blend in. The complex schedules that we have to create, obviously we have to work it around the, the passenger loads as well. It's a constant change. It's, with any other FM facility we might be able to you know, have, a, have a planned uh, PPM schedule that will maintain, stay the same throughout the year. Uh, with the airport we have to work around the flights that are coming in. If there's a delayed flight then we'll have to change our schedules because of that. Uh, you know, if we plan to clean a boarding gate but then half the, the flight's delayed by half an hour then we then have to change the time that we clean the boarding gate. Um, so it really is quite reactive um, but in a planned environment so we still have to make sure that we cover everything. So Emerald offers a full range of facilities management, so we deliver hard and soft services, um, we deliver energy management, asset management, security services, and we're currently delivering that across the UAE um, in a lot of prestigious sites. Um, so obviously our aim would be to develop uh, not just delivering cleaning services within the airport, but to try and uh, tap into the other services that are available. And from the training perspective, we do have the NIC EIC accreditation, um, which allows us to deliver electrical training airside if we need to, so if we were to branch out into that side of facilities then we're already set up and ready to go for it.